right, ZBR. Uh, it's hard to watch uh, trailers like live and not end up with a copyright strike. So to do the um, the one you're yeah, talking so about, it? oh, full money, the full the full money is on what YouTube. Yeah, um, but we could try to navigate that and see if we could figure something out. I don't know how well that'll play. Um, I could have downloaded it and then re-uploaded it. That probably would have been better, but we're not doing that. We're just going to do this. I'm going to modify it a little bit, and we'll play a little bit at a time and see what happens. Because I didn't know about this. Okay. All right. So it says, the older I get, to realize everybody's a bit mad. Yeah, I realize everyone's a bit mad. So right off the bat, I agree. There's there there is some appeal to the fact that you would see the original cast back together. I can't even remember the last time I've seen the the full Monty. Is it a, a ZBR? I'm assuming this is a really big deal overseas because here in America it's sort of like a forgotten film. I don't even think people remember how fun the full Monty is or was um, because it was all like stuff new for us when it happened, and I, I don't think it's. Like in our, it's not, it's not like in our regular cycle of conversation over here or anything. So they're going to just flash right back to then and then kind of go. Cool. For one night only, we're going to go for the full Monty. Only going for the full Monty. And all the ladies are cheering. So ladies night. Um, they're going to drop it all, man. They're going to show it all. That was the premise of the show. So, um, yeah, fingers crossed. Looks good. Fingers crossed. We'll see. It's a British classic. Okay. Yeah, it's sort of a forgotten thing for us. Uh, I don't know where FX will stream for us. So, I don't, if F FX has its own app or something, I don't know what they have here in the States. I'd have to look into where it will actually land because that would be a limiting factor for me to watch it, ZBR. <laughs> I'm going to say this is all, that was all still original movie stuff. So fast forward 25 years. Has it really been 25 years? 97. Yeah. Wow. Five years. Sure enough. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. I love Robert Carl Carlyle and Mark Addy. I mean, those are great. They're just, they're so talented in everything that they do. I've, I've always just been, very, very, um, I, I just admire their work. I really do. Um, Mark Addy's been in a ton of stuff that I enjoy. Uh, so yeah, I guess we'll see. Um, so yeah, this is the, uh, full Monty teaser. They're all front and center with these, uh, with the two main guys. So let's see what, uh, see what happens next. Says they're still trying. Go and get yourself a proper bloody job. Okay, playing up the gags. Get yourself a bloody job, right? Just being the losers, not taking real work, that kind of thing. So fair enough. Trying to get their act together. You could go places if you wanted. You're a dad. I just hope you don't wake up one day and realize what you've missed. That's supposed to be the daughter. It's his daughter. So she's like. Um, a different different race, so she's switched. Hmm. Okay. I don't know. Just didn't see it coming. Just didn't know. Guess we'll see. Is it going to be more about them? We're not going to have a switch, are we, ZBR? Right? We're not. Please tell me we're not. <laughs> this isn't going to be, here's Robert Carlyle and Mark Addy, and we're going to get a show about four or five people that I don't know. Is that what's going to happen, ZBR? I'm a little concerned. Is that what's going to happen? Another rich, get rich quick scheme. Okay. All right. All right, ZBR. We're going a little further. Let's see what happens here. You're pregnant. I'm not bloody pregnant. Thank God for that. Just different shots. It's fine. I don't know. I don't have an opinion here. Graffiti art. Sheffield's next big thing. Whatever crazy scheme he's cooked up, just say no. I am the. So it's a, it's yeah, it's just more of that get rich quick type shenanigans that Robert Carlyle's character is going for. Um, okay. 
So we don't, do we know how much of this is center? I mean, they're, they're, they're front and center on the poster. So I'm assuming that they're going to be a major player in this show. It's not going to be a bait and switch, but I could be wrong. So the graffiti artist. Okay, here we go. Uh, schizophrenic. Winner. The Academy Award winning writer of Full Monty and Slumdog Millionaire. Uh oh, we got a bully scene, shaved head girl. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, there's some yellow flags along the way with the cast and, and what we're looking at here. Um, what do I know her from? Do I know her from something? What is her name? Her name is Talitha Wing. Talitha Wing. Hmm. Nope. She just happens to look like someone else that I've seen. So, nope. Don't know her from anything. This is kind of a big deal for her to get this role. Okay. So, so far it's about six or seven episodes. So. Bullying. They shouldn't be tolerated. You're all right for fat break, you know. Well, again, a little fat white guy jokes. That's all fine. That's all good. I'm down with all that. That's all good. Keep those coming. I'm good on that. Mark Addy can pull all that off. If things are tricky at your mom's, you can always come and stay at mine if you like. Hmm. All right. So that's the mum. So good dad type stuff, maybe. What's that noise? Police helicopter. It's all right. It's going. All right. Well, you know, again, this is how good the writers are. I don't know. So it definitely could work. Um, I don't know. So did, um, what's the name? Simon Bo Bofoy? He's the writer, isn't he? I think he wrote the original stuff, right? So is he the writer for everything? Is he the one running the show here? Because if he's if he's running the show, I have a lot more confidence in this working because um, Simon uh, Beaufoy is actually very talented. And God help me, I hope I'm saying his name properly. Go in. It's gone. Snowflakes have taken over the asylum. Over the asylum. This place is a madhouse. Oh, he's so good. I like him too. I don't remember his name. You guys have to tell me his name. I don't remember his name. It's sometimes hard to keep track of some of the actors that you love like that. Tom Wilkinson. That's it, Tom Wilkinson. He has been in so many great things. He's done so many good works as well. Tom Wilkinson is a very underrated performance. Character actor, he's done so many good shows. I really loved him in things like Snowden, even. Just good stuff. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. I've got it. You were stripless. Hey. Are you still doing, still doing it? it? What do you think? That's funny. That's good. Yeah, I don't know. DBR, good job. Oh, that's right. He did play Falcone. You're right. Yeah. He's good. I just Tom Tom Wilkinson's just got some great roles. He's just got some great roles. I I, I don't know that I've ever like. Uh, I don't know. He's done. I mean, it's just there's so many roles he's been in. He's, he obviously was in. I think he's been what the, he's done a couple of the Mission Impossible films. He was in. Um, oh come on! What's the name of the Martin Luther King movie? Um, come on, guys. Selma. Did I get that right? I think it's Selma. Oh, it's going to be on Hulu. Okay. All right. Well, there we go. That answers my earlier question about where I can watch it. I don't currently have Hulu, I don't think. Um, but, hey. ZBR, I'm not going to rule that out. That actually looks like it could be fun. And right now, comedy and fun is a rarity. It's an oddity. You've heard me go on and on about this a lot lately. So maybe that's the kind of thing where... Uh, you know, have to make a point of going and getting it and finding it and watching it because it's such an oddity. Like I heard, you know, because on Hulu, it's that um, horrible Mel Brooks history of the world part two thing they did. And I heard just so many horrible things about it. I wouldn't even subject myself to it because I love the original stuff so much. Yeah. <laughs> right